the meantime, thousands of migrants are reaching their 30-day limit at shelter citywide, and many have been lining up in the cold so they can be placed all over again. CBS 2's Christy Kalishan reports from the East Village. Volunteers emptied out bags of fruit they passed out to asylum seekers waiting in line outside the former St. Bridget School in the East Village. There has to be a better plan than this. Assembly member Harvey Epstein's office is across the street from the line, which he says has grown over the last month and a half from hundreds to thousands a day. As the city is out of space to house migrants, Epstein has donated jackets and winter gear in his office ready to give away. We talk to the, the city every day and they know it's a problem. Um, we, you know, we're looking for, we want them to have a backup center so you can have people waiting, but they don't have to wait outside in the cold. Single adult asylum seekers came to the site to be placed in new city shelters after their 30 day limit expires, some carrying all the belongings they own. This man had over 9,600 people in front of him in line for a room on Wednesday. He says in Spanish he will have to wait about two weeks to get a room. Others are concerned about the winter storm this weekend. I'm worried. I'm worry at this weekend. It's so freezing. You know it's freezing. First time in snow. You know, I'm giving shoes, gloves, socks, a bathrobe. Some neighbors came Friday with items to donate to Epstein's office. Advocates worry for those who come as early as 4 a.m. to wait in line. We're concerned people are going to freeze to death. We're concerned people are going to do what it takes to wait in line for their appointments uh, and, and have to deal with, with their just biological needs at this point. Maman Mamoudi with nonprofit East Village or EV Loves NYC has been handing out food to asylum seekers, concerned for their well-being. Here all their clothes are going to be soaking wet, all their life and belonging, all their documents that are these pieces of paper, their asylum paper in their hand, they might lose that and then that's going to open their lives. EV Loves NYC plans to give out warm food and drinks this weekend to those waiting in line in hopes of making the stormy conditions more bearable. In the East Village, Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News.